Good afternoon everyone. I'm out in the forest. I'll show you around in a moment. Now in daylight and I come across this place yesterday. It was a good reminder that there are many obstacles in life and there's different ways we can approach them. So let me show you what I did yesterday. I come across this spot. There's a lot of trees down. There's really not a good way to move forward. I left going back toward that way to another path. But I kept being drawn to this area. So then what I did, I came back down far enough into the wood that actually I could step on the wood and gain a new perspective. That's my little drum over there. Then I start to walk and balance on the wood. Which is not easy. The wood being wet and moving around. But I kept going. And I'm not going to go all the way today. But down the road there's an other wood piece that then took me over to the big piece of wood and behind it there was a trail and I'm just telling you this as I'm standing here balancing on this piece of wood that obstacles come and obstacles go but there's a way that you can find a new a new rhythm a new space something that works for you. I'm going back to what in a way. So just focusing not to fall down. But there is times in our lives, many times, when we will find things right across in our path and feel like there is no way forward. Because when we come back down, it looks like an impossible task, like I'm going to climb through over that and I'm going to get poked and all that. But going back a few steps and getting on the piece of wood when it was smaller and walking across and find another path to walk to another piece of wood and to another piece of wood to get back to a path. That led me to the neighbor's property here. <laughs> so I had to turn back and walk my way back to a different part of the forest, which had no path at all. So I had to make my own path. And the whole thing with that is that that is what life is all about. We are making our own paths. And no matter how bad things get, there's always a way forward. And you are magical, you are beautiful, you are amazing, just the way you are. You have to do nothing to change yourself. You can always improve, you can seek help, support, guidance, build your community of amazing people around you. But you are amazing just the way you are. The first person who told me that, that was Mara Muter, and she's an amazing metaphysician, and I really appreciate that message. It's been taking me a long time to take that really internally and realize, yes, I am fine, I'm enough, I am beautiful the way I am. I don't have to be a certain, I don't have to look a certain way, or I don't have to meet somebody's expectation to know that I'm a whole beautiful myself and that's the same for for you as well so I'm gonna leave with that message and I'm gonna do a little video just right after this with a little bit of drumming right out in nature may your day be joyful until I see you next time <laughs>